The Iron Fist lightweight decoupled system is making waves in the defense community, redefining what it means to be armored in modern warfare. Developed by Israeli firm Elbit Systems, this lightweight bolt-on system is a force to be reckoned with. Easily integrated into American Bradleys, Strikers, and even M1 Abrams tanks, the Iron Fist offers 360-degree coverage, advanced radar, and the ability to neutralize a wide range of threats before they reach the crew. Analysts around the world already joke that militaries worldwide will now require an anti-rocket rocket on their rockets to counter their anti-rocket rocket from the Iron Fist. All this capability comes without altering the vehicle's structure, setting a new benchmark for defensive systems. In 2016, while the United States Armed Forces were still deployed in the Middle East, facing numerous challenges and casualties at the hands of enemy rocket-propelled grenades or RPGs, the Army determined it required an interim APS, or Active Protection System, solution for some of its armored vehicles. These included the powerful M1A1 Abrams, Striker Combat Vehicle, and the Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle. The operational need was deemed urgent, and the Army quickly assessed off-the-shelf APS systems. The Army had already tested and fielded the Rafael-developed Trophy APS system on M1 Abrams tanks in Europe. Nonetheless, the less powerful vehicles employed by the infantry required a different system, better suited for their own needs and internal power. The aim was to look for an effective system that could provide Stryker and Bradley vehicles with active protection from anti-tank guided missiles or ATGMs, rocket-propelled grenades, and other threats. As a result, the Army decided to test the Iron Fist lightweight decoupled system developed by IMI Systems. The Israeli firm Elbit Systems later purchased IMI. They partnered with General Dynamics Ordnance and Tactical Systems to develop the APS for the Bradley. Elbit Systems has stated, the Iron Fist series of active protection systems, or APSs, delivers high performance protection against anti-tank threats while increasing the survivability of the platform or vehicle that employs it. The series includes a light configuration for infantry fighting vehicles, armored fighting vehicles, and cargo vehicles. The heavier configuration is optimized for main battle tanks, or MBTs. Both versions provide interception of anti-armor threats with precise detection technologies that detect, identify the threat, and respond with the necessary capabilities to neutralize it while ensuring the crew's safety. The Iron Fist can eradicate any hostile threat in different scenarios and weather conditions with a state-of-the-art blast interceptor that eliminates the projectile without activating its lethal warhead. Perhaps the most crucial aspect of this effective protection system is its weight, which is light enough to not hamper the crew's or the vehicle's operational capabilities. The platform is lightweight, coming up at 220 pounds per side and a total weight of over 550 pounds for the entire platform. General Dynamics has described the Iron Fist as an all-in-one, pre-calibrated unit with small dimensions and low silhouette. It requires little power to operate, and more importantly, has a bolt-on capability, eliminating the need for penetrating the vehicle's structure and turning the Iron Fist active protection system into the ultimate add-on for enhanced survivability. Iron Fist's unique sensor suite provides detection, classification, and hostile fire source locations against anti-armor threats. The sensor suite encompasses two different sensing technologies for optimal threat acquisition. These are radar and optics, providing the system and operators with the most reliable data available, greatly reducing the number of false alarms under real combat scenarios. It automatically detects and identifies RPGs, ATGMs, and recoilless rifle ammunition. The heavier version of the Iron Fist can even handle heat or high-explosive anti-tank ammunition. If that was not impressive enough, this sensor suite can handle simultaneous threats to maximize the vehicle's protection and counterattack capabilities if engaged by multiple enemy targets. For threat neutralization, the Iron Fist computerized control unit receives data from the sensors and then calculates the adequate interception point and time to successfully neutralize the incoming enemy projectile at a safe distance from the platform. The small blast interceptor warhead counters the hostile threat by producing a shockwave effect at the precise time that results in the destruction of the threat without initiating its lethal warhead. The shockwave effect leads to the creation of a jet formation with minimal residual effects for the defenders. As stated before, Elbit Systems Iron Fist was designed with versatility in mind without compromising the performance of the vehicle that employs it. The small form and light weight of the Iron Fist puts a minimal burden on the main battle tank of the fighting vehicle that uses it. 
In addition to its quick mounting and dismounting capabilities, the system enables open hatch operations without interfering in already established tank or armored vehicle tactics. As a result, the modular and compact design of the Iron Fist makes it fully compatible with an ample array of vehicle platforms. It can be easily maintained, calibrated, and integrated without additional modifications. The Iron Fist fully integrates with current systems, such as fire control systems, battle management systems, and Elkin's own Iron Vision see-through armor technology. Moreover, the sensor suite enhances the crew's awareness capabilities with a 360-degree day and night surveillance site and a hostile fire detection system to detect gunshot fire and pinpoint the approximate location of small arms burst detonations. With this impressive coverage of situational awareness, the crew can remain safe in any close-range scenarios, be it under intense urban skirmishes or open-terrain control encounters. The Iron Fist system comprises an HMI panel PC and a master arm connected to a main control unit. The MCU is linked to two launcher control units located on the right and left side of the vehicle. Each launcher control unit comprises a launcher with countermeasures, radar, and optics. After years of several testing phases, the U.S. Army moved forward with incorporating the Iron Fist protection system on the Bradley in mid-2021. Brigadier General Glenn Dean, the program executive officer for Army Ground Combat Systems, told Defense News, quote, There's a little bit left to go, and then some integration work, but we're essentially reaching the point where we're just waiting for resources, whether Army or congressionally provided, to proceed into procurement. Months later, in early 2022, Elbit Systems announced the Iron Fist Active Protection System had successfully completed a series of interception tests in challenging scenarios, paving the way for its incorporation into Israel's Defense Force Atan APC and Caterpillar D-9 bulldozers. These triumphs were later echoed with the U.S. Army's January 2023 tests of Iron Fist systems employed on Bradley's. After almost five years of testing, the Army was pleased to announce it was only a matter of time before the APS was officially integrated into the reliable American armored vehicles. Analysts believe that sooner or later, the Iron Fist system will make its way to the battlefield of Ukraine to fend off Russian missiles and other anti-tank projectiles.